मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट दिस इज द पार्ट नंबर टू ऑफ प्रोटेक्शन फ्रॉम वाइल्ड एनिमल्स विच इज़ अ क्रॉप प्रोडक्शन एंड टेक्नोलॉजी विच इज़ अ चैप्टर नंबर ट्वेल्व इन दैट वी ऑलरेडी स्टार्टेड अबाउट द थ्री एनिमल्स नाउ फोर्थ एनिमल इज अ डियर आनी नेक्स्ट इत ऑलवेज रिमेम्बर डियर आर इन्क्लूडेड इन द एंटेल ऑफ फैमिली एंड द एंटलस आर फास्ट ग्रोविंग लिविंग टिश्यू इन द वर्ल्ड दे आर antlers uh, this is the pointed bony structure on their head which is called as antlers there are over 60 different species of uh, deers are present worldwide and during the mating season male deer will often use their antlers to fight and uh, to attract the attention of female deer deer are present on all continents except the antarctica the length of pregnancy in deer varies according to the size generally in large species the longer gestation period is observed deer is tropical climate can be bred all year around and all the species of deer have a, a four chambered stomach which allow them to chew the cud this process of partial chewing uh, chewing food regurgitating it chewing it again to make easier to digest and a, ma- a male deer is called as a buck but the some larger males are called as a stags a female deer is called as a do or hind a young deer is called as a fawn now nature of damage deer frequently prefer agricultural crops rather than the wild foods uh, there has been surge of damage among the farms and gardens just two deer can produce a herd of up to 35 deer in just 7 years in addition to flower beds and vegetable gardens corn peas cotton watermelon peanuts and gram crops experienced the most damage from the deer now how we can control them a wild deer can have impact on agricultural production and environment main methods are first trapping second ground and aerial shooting it's banned now third which is a fencing uh it uh, it is three types wire fencing plastic fencing and electric fencing which is called as duck uh, jutka machine and fourth is a fire crackers and fifth one is a dogs next fifth one is a uh, blue bull or nilgai this blue bull is the largest asian antelope and most commonly seen as a wild animal in a india you can see in this picture this is the blue bull uh, or nilgai nature of damage the nilgai is highly adaptive antelope naturally diurnal and it goes for field crop grazing in the evening and night it is also found to damage most agricultural crops whereas is high density nilgai areas damage to the wheat gram mug mustard crop is caused not only by grazing but also through the trampling resting in the field and daily movements of the animals a major constraint on control is that the nilgai is an animal of considerable religious reverence as most people is affected area are religious this are the nature of damage now how can we control by fencing wire fencing plastic fencing electric fencing or jatka machine then fire crackers pet dogs can control blue bull and beating of drums and last which is the sixth one wild rabbit these wild rabbits cause severe damage to the crops and the main predator of rabbit is a fox while young rabbits also fall to bird attack as a prey nature of damage rabbits are herbivorous uh, they feed by eating uh, weeds grasses clover wild flower and vegetable plants and other crops in warmer season this rabbit's damage is almost always the result of their appetite for plants they eat flower and vegetable plant during the spring summer and the bark of fruit and also ornamental trees and shrub in fall of winter this is the nature of a damage always remember the male is called as a buck and the female as a doe uh, rabbits are generally 40 to 45 cm in length and have ears that measures about 8.5 cm long they have compact body with long powerful hind legs the smallest uh, pygmy rabbit have only 20 cm of body length 
and 0.4 kg in weight while the largest rabbit grown to 50 cm and more than 2 kg. The rabbits are abundant in a grassland areas where the soil allows them to make extensive well-drained burrows where there are heads or patches of woodland to give shelter and cover. Rabbits are herbivores who feed by grazing on grass, corpy, leafy weeds. However, they also eat all vegetables. Then they are generally able to breed at young age and many regularly produce up to seven young ones at about so four or five times in year 22 or uh, 28 to 31 days. Newborn rabbits are uh, naked, blind and helpless at birth. And mothers are remarkably inattentive to their young and are almost absent. Absent parents commonly nursing their young, young only once per day for just few minutes. The milk of rabbit is highly nutritious and among the richest of all mammals. The young grow rapidly and most are grown up in a, about a month. How we can control the white rabbits? First, traps and snares. Use of cage traps, drop box trap or spring traps. Place them where they live, uh, will expose to severe uh, weather. Place them near, near a fox earth or bad girl set. Use self-locking snares. Use only approved traps. Second, fencing. Use of cotton wire nets, strain wire, similar to the kind used uh, user to manage cattle and sheep permanent wire mesh, uh, netting, etc. Then ferreting a domesticated poly cat used for the catching the rabbits. There are three types of fencing controlling. Uh, electric uh, netting, electric strain wire, similar to the kind used to manage the cattle and sheep. Then permanent wire mesh netting. Fifth one is the petting is the most cost effective way to reduce the rabbit population that is uh, Example 1080, which is a sodium fluoroacetate rapid weight is available. You can see in this picture, this is the electric fencing. And this chapter is over. We will see next chapter in the next lecture. Thank you.